in this video, I'm going to show you how to get Fortnite Save the World for free. Welcome back to the channel, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far and in this video I'll be showing you guys a glitch that is going to allow you to get Fortnite Save the World for free. This requires no money at all and you can actually get to play it for free and with that even earn free V-Bucks too. And also this tip trick or glitch, whatever you want to call it, is extremely easy and fast to do. And best of all, you will not get banned for doing this. Now real quick, thank you so much for 2 million subscribers. This weekend we managed to reach this incredible milestone. It is literally a dream coming true and I still cannot thank you guys enough. Now to celebrate this, I want to do a cool little giveaway here on the channel. I'm going to give away another iconic bundle including the iconic skin and the scenario emote. Last iconic skin giveaway was successful so why not do it again now if you want to have a chance of winning this bundle all you have to do is first of all subscribe to the channel and from there drop a like on this video and also make sure to leave a comment down below telling me the console that you play on from there stay tuned here on the channel as I will be picking a random lucky subscriber and announcing him or her in an upcoming video as regards to all the last giveaways congratulations to it's Kian, Tech A, Derp Troll, and Infinity Hero 09 YT for winning 1000 V-Bucks during the live stream. Also, congratulations to Mr. Chicken for winning the Lava Legends pack. I'm getting in contact with all the winners right now and they're receiving their prize very soon. Anyways, if you are going to enjoy the video, be sure to give the like down below and let's do another like goal on this video. You guys have been smashing these like goals every single time lately. So can we get 7,777 likes on this video? If we can reach that like goal, it would make my day and I hope this video does make your day. Now also, subscribe for more videos like these and by the way, I will be replying to each and every single comment down below in the comment section. And if you've turned on your notifications, be sure to comment hashtag notification squad and it will give your comment a heart. And if you don't believe me, try it out yourself and your comment will get a heart. Anyways, let's get straight into this video. Alright, so big shout out to Shadow for allowing me to use his gameplay. Make sure to check out his channel if you enjoy the Save the World for free videos of course. And he uploads them a lot. The link to his channel will be down below in the description, so make sure to show him some support. Alright, so as you guys know, Fortnite has two different game modes. The free battle royale game mode and the co-op PvE Save the World game mode, which you have to pay for. We have the Save the World Standard Edition, the Deluxe Edition, the Super Deluxe Edition, and the Limited Edition, and they all range from $40 up to $100. So, you can tell that this game mode is pretty expensive, and you do not want to buy it and ending up not liking it. So, with this glitch, you can just try it out and decide for yourself if it is worth buying. I did this glitch on the Xbox One, but this will probably also work for the PlayStation 4 and the PC. Just try it out and basically follow the same steps and see if it works for the console that you play on. Now, one more thing, you will be needing a friend's account that already has Fortnite Save the World on it. So, if you have a friend who plays Fortnite Save the World, ask him or her if you can use his or her account to do this glitch. Also tell him not to worry as after the glitch worked, he can just log in into his account again and play Save the World. Now, I suggest to not share your account details in the comment section down below. Only do this with a friend that is really trustable or who you know in real life. Anyways, let's start with the glitch. Alright, so as you can see on screen, I currently do not own Fortnite Save the World on this account. This way, you guys know that this is not a scam. Okay, so the first thing I recommend doing is to basically completely restart your console or start up Fortnite again by closing the application. From there, once you're on the main menu, what you need to do is go over to your home screen and go to accounts. From there, switch over to your friend's account that has Fortnite Save the World on it and wait for it to sign in. After it's signed in, go back to Fortnite and you'll get this message that says Log out occurred. Switching profiles has returned to the title screen, retry. From there, once you're sitting on the menu, just go back to your home screen and switch over to your own account again. Now, when you go back to Fortnite, just log in onto press a button to start menu and wait for Fortnite to put you onto the main menu. Then, once you're on the main menu, click on Save the World and you can now play Fortnite Save the World on your own account without even buying it. From this point, you can completely log out of your friend's account, so you can just start using it as well. He can just freely use his account again, just like you were before. You might even be able to play Fortnite Save the World together from now on. From this point, you can explore Fortnite Save the World and even grind out some V-Bucks. And of course, with those V-Bucks, you can buy yourself free items. Now do note that this is not a permanent method. You'll have to go ahead and do this every single time when you hop on Fortnite. 
But what's that? This only takes like a minute or so to do. But whatever, this way you can try it Fortnite Save the World and see if you like it or not. Pretty awesome in my opinion. Now, one more time, if you want me to find an exclusive Fortnite Save the World for free glitch for the PlayStation 4 or the PC, make sure to leave a like on this video and leave a comment saying that. I will try my best to find one. Also worth to mention, Fortnite Save the World is becoming a free to play game very soon. At least, that's what Epic Games is telling us. This is what they said on their website last year. Hey, Fortnite friends. Since our last states of developers, we have been heads down on learning from our recent updates, working on major changes to prepare for the free to play and continuing to add to save the world. They also said no free to play in 2018. We decided to move the free to play launch of save the world out of this year, working on a broad set of features, reworks and backend system scaling that we believe are needed to go free to play. And they even published a video about that on their official Fortnite YouTube channel. So enjoy this clip right here. Hello Fortnite community, Billy here from the Save the World team with a special announcement. After careful consideration, we've decided to delay the full free to play launch of Save the World out of 2018. Since the initial release of the game, we've added several new features and quality of life improvements, along with new events, heroes, and items. We still have more we'd like to do before going free. We want to make sure that all of our players, both old and new, have a great experience, so we'll be doing some technical and performance work in order to handle the scale of a full launch. Additionally, we've got some great new features and surprises coming up throughout the rest of the year and into 2019. Okay, so of course, it's already April 2018, which means we're already a couple of months into 2018, which then means we could see the release of Fortnite Save the World anytime soon possibly even with the release of Season 9. Now, as we all know, while you have yourself purchased Fortnite Save the World, you pretty much own one of the Founders Packs too. Now, as soon as you buy the pack, you're receiving free items in Battle Royale too. These are not new, you probably already know them, but they are the legendary skin named the Rose Team Leader, the legendary skin named Warpaint, and their matching bag blinks named the Pursuit Bag Bling and the Skirmish Bag Bling. Now, the cool thing about these is the following. Players who already own these skins or players who are going to buy Fortnite Safety World very soon will even receive more free items to complete this set in Battle Royale. We now have the skin with bag blings, but we're also going to get a matching harvesting tool and glider for both these skins. Leakers have found these items in the game files and this is what they look like. This is the harvesting tool for the Rose Team Leader and as you can see it's all pink and stuff, but I guess the harvesting tool for the war paint is going to look the exact same, but then in the blue variant, of course. Now, this is what the matching glider will look like. This is the glider for the male skin, because it's kind of in a blue-gray theme. But of course, the female skin will receive the same one, but then in her style. And of course, we can get a lot of V-Bucks with Fortnite Save the World 2, like I said. And here are a couple of ways. Okay, the first method is by completing quests. These quests or missions are pretty much in-game objectives or challenges and once you complete them, you get rewarded with V-Bucks. There are several different quests which you can complete. First of all, we have the daily quests. Every day, there are three new daily quests to complete and most of them will give you 50 V-Bucks. Now, that means you can get about 150 V-Bucks each day just by completing these daily quests. And these daily quests aren't even that hard at all. They're pretty easy. Now, moving on, we have the challenges. As you can see, not all challenges will give you V-Bucks, but a couple of them will, and they can range from anywhere between 30 up to 50 V-Bucks as well. Then we have side quests and main quests, and these can give you 100 V-Bucks each, which is a lot. Then another way to earn V-Bucks is by completing timed missions. Anyways, just by playing the game, you can earn thousands, and I mean thousands of V-Bucks. From there, another great way to get V-Bucks in Fortnite Save the World is by doing your collection book. In a collection book, you can consume heroes, survivors, and defenders to put into your collection. You can also recruit some items from the book to obtain it. Each item can be put in once and it grants your collection book some experience based on the rarity and level of the item. Consuming heroes levels up your collection book faster than the others. There are rewards up to level 500. So pretty much, just put in unneeded things in your collection book and it will level up. Now, at level 6, 26, and 91, you will get 500 V-Bucks. So, that's a total of 1,500 V-Bucks. Then last but not least, the most easiest way to get V-Bucks is just by logging in Fortnite Save the World each and every single day. Because each time you log into Fortnite, you're going to receive a free reward and sometimes it could be V-Bucks. Here on screen is a list of every daily login reward that grants V-Bucks. If you would log into Fortnite Save the World for 336 days in a row, you can actually get over 10 thousand V-Bucks and after that day 336 the cycle starts again from day one. 
So that means you can get 10,000 V-Bucks for free each and every single year, just by logging in for that safety rule. Now, that's just insane. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. But with all that being said, always remember, this was Shuffle Gamer, and I am signing out.